My name is Paul Halley. I'm the director of music here at King's and I'm the proud father of two King's graduates, two daughters, Vanessa and Samantha. My daughters <coughs> um, uh, are the reason I, I was interested in King's in the first place. They uh, were looking at universities when they were 17, you know, the last year of high school or whatnot. And my younger daughter, Samantha, has always had a slightly kind of quirky approach to, uh, the, you know, the main beaten path. Um, and so we were looking at all these catalogs and brochures, I mean, they were really, um, of universities. Of course, 90% of them were in the States. But Samantha found one from King's. And unlike, really, unlike all the others, it, it made no effort whatsoever to be in any way politically correct or, or, or even uh, to make itself out to be something for everybody. It, it just presented itself as what it was, which was an intense learning environment. And Samantha saw that right away and she just singled it out and she said, you know, what do you think about this? I said, it looks fantastic. The King's represents a kind of sanctuary um, where the things I really, really care about um, are, are honored and respected and thought about and talked about and acted upon. Um, but it's a laboratory insofar as I think that King's is cutting edge. I, th I think that King's offers a way forward um, to a lot of, uh, for a lot of people, a lot of educational institutions who, who have sort of lost their way, in a sense. Um, in, you know, by, by really holding on firmly to what matters um, in, in the past and in the heritage, uh, King's has actually pointed the way forward. It basically um, is saying, I think to all the students, look, we, we, we take our place in a great tradition. And unless the students understand that sense of context and the brilliance of the heritage that they have basically been handed, they can't, I don't think, really move competently into the future. The difference to, to Vanessa and Samantha was enormous. Uh, they still have um, the, 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 um, the text, which of course are the original, you know, for Foundation Year, uh, year uh, program. They are the actual first original sources. They're not reading about it, they're reading, you know, they're reading Goethe, they're reading Plato, you know. And they still have them and they still refer to them. And it's not unusual if I'm down there and we're having dinner for one of them to you know, just grab one of those books and read from it, you know, to support an argument. So, so King's, in a way, might look like an irrelevance, but strangely, it turns out to be deeply relevant and deeply important and critical in the lives of, of, of my kids who came here, and I think that's true of most of the students who came here.